Hello children, in today's video we will learn about angles and its type. So first of all, let us learn what is an angle. When two rays or two line segments meet each other at a point, we get an angle. The two rays OA and OB, when they meet at O, we get angle A, O, B and this point O is called the vertex of the angle and the rays O, A and O, B are called sides or arms of the angle. Now here we have angle A, O, B and how to represent the angle? We represent the angle by the tilted L. Now to represent this angle AOB, we first write tilted L, then we write the alphabets A, then vertex O, and then B. This is angle AOB, or we can also write tilted L, then B, O, A. Now children, note down, the vertex of the angle is always kept in the middle. Here, we have written O in the middle. Then, how to measure the angle? The angles are measured in degrees and we use protector to measure the angles. If we have a look on this protector, this represents the baseline. Then we have 0 degrees, 10 degrees, so on. Here we have 90 degrees. Then proceeding like this, here we have 180 degrees. This is the inner scale. Similarly, there is an outer scale on the protector. There also we have 0 degrees, 10 degrees. Continuing like this, here is 90 degrees and here we have 180 degrees. So now, any angle which lies between 0 degrees to 90 degrees, that is called an acute angle. And the angle whose measure is exactly 90 degrees is called right angle and any angle whose measure lies between 90 degrees to 180 degrees that is called an obtuse angle. So now let us learn about the various types of angles in details. So first type of the angle is acute angle. Acute as the name says, acute means very less or very small. Any angle whose measure lies between 0 degrees and 90 degrees is called an acute angle. For example, 60 degrees, 70 degrees, we have 45 degrees and 20 degrees acute angle on the screen. Next type is obtuse angle. An angle whose measure lies between 90 degrees and 180 degrees is called an obtuse angle. We have the obtuse angles of 120 degrees, 150 degrees. You can take any other angle also. Here we have an angle of 120 degrees. See, this measures more than 90. That is why this 120 degrees is an obtuse angle. Next, we have right angle an angle whose measure is 90 degrees is called a right angle here we have right angle a o b now if we have to represent it we represent it like this angle a o b this measures 90 degrees next we have straight angle an angle of 180 degrees is called a straight angle it is represented by a line. Reflex angle, an angle whose measure lies between 180 degrees and 360 degrees is called a reflex angle. For example, 270 degrees and 320 degrees. Here we have the reflex angle of 311 degrees and 210 degrees. The next angle is zero angle. An angle whose measure is 0 degrees is called a 0 angle. In 0 angle, both the arms, they overlap each other. 
the next is whole angle an angle whose measure is exactly 360 degrees is called a whole angle we also call it full angle now in this video we have learnt about acute angle right angle obtuse angle straight angle reflex angle full angle and zero degrees angle